farewell to Newark. Farewell. MDCCC XLV111. M M thousands in it. D is 500. It's on D D D. Oh, no idea. Let's look it up. You can hear me. It's very windy. Castle. Castle Barge. There's a water point on that one. Somebody's on it. It's electric here, I know it works. My mates told me. This is Kiln Visitors Mooring. Look at that, there's one there. I could have had that. Aqua Vista. King's Waterside and Marina. Ooh, some narrowboats in there as well. shots going down the Trent are just far too windy to use. That's an amazing view, isn't it? That, that the con contrast in those bridge and that building, that amazing. Right, we've got a green light here. We're good to go. We've got a weir here, which is quite, pulling me quite a bit. through bridge when the red light shows so I'm good to go. Oh there's one of those turbines there down in Oxford. Same can you see that? Creating power. Those Archimedes screws. Amazing. This is bridge 27 and this is gonna be a short right lock of the day. Quite a deep one. All the lock keepers have been fabulous on this stretch on the Trent. Really really good people. structure isn't it I like the uh, I like the pads they use as anti-vibration platforms that they sit on very interesting as you can see here it's just it's just it's getting quite flat and windy and it's you know it's really difficult to get any sound oh look there's a fellow boater coming our way to get any sound out of these clips now. We've got the A1 there, the bridge. Taking the A1 over the uh, Trent. Very choppy as you can see. So it's a strange, it feels like you're going against, you're going down river but it feels like you're going against the flow because of the waves, the choppiness in the waves. It's an optical illusion type thing, you know. the bloody winds died down and uh, checking the fruits of my labor those sweet strawberries ready for the breakfast leave it alone mate this is the uh, Cromwell lock where I, where I 
broke down and snapped my throttle cable. Look at that boat, it's four stories I think it is. You've got lower deck, middle deck, upper deck, and upper deck. Massive thing it was. Cracking place. I've been here for, I've been here for uh, one night. I'll turn around. I'm gonna go into that lock there, Cromwell Lock. Let's go. As I was turning around here, I, t I turned around okay, but as I was just going into the lock, I lost all my power and the throttle cable went, so I had to uh, bash into the wall and climb out. It wasn't very nice. still using it or not, I'm not sure. It looks a bit uh, disused doesn't it? Probably transporting gravel or you know or something from the uh, gravel pits onto the boats. Transporting it, days gone by. That is maximum power. That's flat out now that is. If I, get to, if I have to use full power to reverse it, I'm stuffed. To be honest I'm crapping myself. That's, uh, that's me moaning there about the old uh, throttle cable. I made a vlog about it if you want to watch it in my one of my listings. This is what is this? Can you comment below? I think it was some type of heron. Look at this windmill, look that beautiful. Somebody's made it into a home. Very nice. A lot of the Trent now is just wide and uh, sort of featureless, apart from the old uh, cows getting their fill of water. Hello mate, you alright? Curious as to what's this metal tube going past. Looks like a, an interesting structure coming up, got the lovely arches. I think it's some kind of uh, viaduct. Yeah, some viaduct going over there, that's amazing. The old uh, graffiti there, look, eh? Yeah. What's he smiling about? He's got nothing to smile about. He's just broken down. Little cormorant there, looking out for his fishy supper. That's pretty with all different colour greens on those trees. Lovely, isn't it? That's the first bit of feature I've seen all this way. Actually, it's just featureless and flat and uh, not very interesting. Careful of these sandbars down the sides, especially on the corners. Some old uh, launch pads there, or, or moorings, whatever it is, for the big boats. If I saw this pontoon, I thought I'd get on here and uh, chill out for a bit. Wow, it looks nice out there, doesn't it? Let's have a look. Ooh, it's nice. You can see that tide line there, or the tide. It's got to turn before I can move. A lovely lot. So I'm going to wait for the water to go up for the tide to turn so I can move. And last night it was flowing that way, now it's flowing that way, so it's really weird on this stretch. Beautiful day. Heaven on the water. Look at this for a nice mooring. In the middle of nowhere. Are you sleeping? This here is a toll bridge. This here is a pipe bridge. A beautiful church in the background there. Look. Dunham on Trent. You've got a church down the road there. That bird. Down the road now, I don't know where it is. A bit battered, but you get the idea. Cables lasted me uh, from Cromwell Lock to here, these beautiful moorings here. Um, I'll show you on the uh, on the film anyway. I'm just, I've adjusted the uh, adjusted the throttle cables a little bit, it gives me a little bit more rear. It's probably about 1800 RPM now, rather than 14. So 
I'll wait for the tide, the tide's going to turn soon. Um, it's about it's 10 to 10 and the tide's going to go whoop, that way rather than that way. So I'm going down river, when the tide turns the flow goes up stream. So I'm waiting for that now, I'll make a cup of tea and get going. And hopefully, fingers crossed, ow, fingers crossed my um, throttle cable doesn't snap again. <sighs> scary, it is scary stuff. Goodbye to this beautiful mooring now. Lovely, isn't it? Look at that views. And this way. Isn't that lovely? This mooring saved my life last night. See the water now, it's just stopped flowing. It's completely still. It's about to turn that way now, so I'm going to turn around and head downstream. skies, no wind, perfect uh, cruising weather. There's a red light on this, I don't know what it's for. Does anybody know? Comment below. Beautiful day, a little bit of wind, but not as bad as yesterday. Lovely. Just going to stop here at this moorings. I want to go and look at that church quickly. I was on that board earlier. Try and get to that church through here, maybe. I'm not sure. Let's have a look. Where is it? It's up there or something. Oh, I don't have to get to it. I don't know how you get to it. I have to walk all the way around here. Uh, can't go that way across the field, don't know where that goes. It's like a really old church, doesn't it? Let's try down here. Getting closer to it. I hope this lane takes me down here. There's a little pub here. It's nice. There we are, I've made it. Churches. Chap, this, oh sorry, sorry, Patience, the wife of W.M. Skelton, who departed this life December the 19th, 1755, and they've done, this, they've done the one as a J almost. Uh, Aged 78 years. So he was born in 1648, wait a minute, take 70 off 50, that is 80, so 1678 was it? Oh god, I can't remember that one. This one is, this one is 17, god, 1600s and stuff, that's 1734, wow, 1741. 1767, 1800s, 1852. These are the early ones. There you are. Beautiful ancient church. Well, I think it's back this way through here. Seems to be a path across the field. Across the field, no doubt. Here we go. Ah, here we are. This is a quick way in. Okay, right. This is what I love about travelling. You pull over, and it's got these little, beautiful little gems. There's that church and stuff, and a beautiful day like this. Nobody about. Oh, magic. What is dreams being built there, isn't it, Lord? Dream house. Wow, stunning. Manor Park. Oh, it's the owner, I bet. Oh, he's worth a bob or two. Spending his wealth. 
fair play. Now this is more like cruising, look at this. Like glass, oh beautiful, and look at these houses. They're lovely aren't they? I wonder if that house there was some old toll house or something. It's got the viewing window hasn't it? So you can see ships coming up and down. Gorgeous. Saying danger, keep, danger, sunken island, keep right. And you think, well how far right and what, how for how long, you know? Something over there, got to be careful of, looks of it. So let's keep right. Do as you told, Will. Oh, I am. Look how big those towers are compared to those people walking. Can you see that? Uh, you will find out. You you're will, not shit at it, right? You, you will. You will look at it when you get back in there, and you'll go, "That's crap." Right, it's just accosted me, right, because he watches my vlogs. What, what's your name? Nick. Name's Nick, and your boat name is? Amy. 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 All right. And Good he's spell. going? A-I-M-E-E. -E. It's spelled A-I-M-E-E. -E. Why is it spelled like that? Uh, it's named after our dog that we had that died. Never quite made it to the boat. Oh, oh that's it's sad. It's reasonable to, oh, that's uh, sad. the dog to come with us summer. Oh, bless. <laughs> and we're here at, where are we? Talksy. Talksy Lock, that's it, Talksy Lock Lock. I mean, it just accosted me. It's Ooh. coming, it's coming, throw, pull me out of the boat. <laughs> We're in a good old chin wag, aren't we? Yes. Thumbs I up for the, you. thumbs up then. Cheers, mate, thank there you. you. This uh, Talksy Lock takes you onto the uh, Foss Dyke, which takes you into Lincoln. There's a lovely car boot here, which I went to. Got some little bargains. <laughs> yep. Went to bed, mate. Go on, I'm going to film your turn in. Oh. <coughs> Thanks. That's definitely going to screw it up, isn't it? <laughs> I'm only putting the good bits. Later on, I bump into Nick again and his lovely missus. And I do a great tour of his boat. Stay tuned. Perfect weather, isn't it, for it? No, actually, Perfect. It's on the Chesterfield and we don't want it to be too hot. No. Laura, Laura, locks. <laughs> is there a lot of locks, is there? Um, there's the most um, staircase locks and any other canal, apparently. Oh, really? So you oh. keep you fit? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I miss the locks, though, I do. I like the locks. Yeah. Not a lot, but I like... We don't want next week, I don't know. Say again. Yeah. You take care, Nick, all right? Thanks, Will. We'll catch you later. Thanks then. for watching my channel. We're watching your channel. <laughs> <laughs> this boat here has got beautiful twin Volvo engines. I'll show you a picture. This is Torxy Lot. We're just going into the Foss Dyke now towards Lincoln. This is a really unusual lock. It's got two sets of gates. I couldn't really work out which one to go in and what to say but the CRT people were there so they uh, told me what to do which is very nice of them both pretty in your own ways I asked the uh, lock keepers if they minded me filming and they said we're not pretty enough so that's where that came from Talksy uh, lock get your words out Will come on 